from director Rich Cristiano comes an inspiring story about the bond of friendship and the power of faith. Secrets of Jonathan Sperry is about a 75-year-old man living in the year 1970 in a small town who starts talking to these three 12-year-old boys to motivate them and want to read the Bible and follow the Lord. He spends time with them and he impacts their lives and changes them forever. Yeah, looks like you've done a real good job here, young man. Mrs. Farley will be very happy. Oh, thank you. I've seen you in our church many times, haven't I? Uh, yeah, you're, um, you're Mr. Sperry, right? That's right, Jonathan Sperry. <laughs> I'm very proud of Gavin playing this role. First of all, he gives it instant credibility. When we were writing the script, we had Gavin in mind for every line. And uh, in my mind, nobody but Gavin McLeod could be Jonathan Sperry. Everything in the Bible is there to make our lives better. Now, the Bible says not to steal. Do you want anyone stealing from you, Mark? No. Well, I guess that's a pretty good thing, isn't it? Yeah, I guess it is. And the Bible says not to lie. Do you want anyone lying to you, Albert? No. Well, I guess that's a pretty good thing, too, isn't it? I never thought of it that way. <laughs> I hardly ever read my Bible. I'm not sure where my Bible is. Me neither. You know, I've been making films since 1957. That's more than half a century. And I've worked with some of the biggest stars in the history of show business. But being Jonathan Sperry is the most rewarding experience I've ever had. I only wish I could be like that man. I think he's an example of what a true, mature Christian is in this movie. And uh, hopefully he'll be a positive influence. The boys in this movie are excellent. Jansen Penetier, who plays Dustin, he's really the lead of the movie. I think I'm gonna ask Tanya out. On a date? I'm thinking about it. You ever asked a girl out before? No. You? No. You, Albert? No. What are you gonna ask her out to? I don't know, walk her home from the diner or invite her to my house. Robert Guillaume is wonderful in this movie. He really is. And I think the audience is really going to like him. You're trying to make me feel guilty for not paying you. No, sir. I just wanted to stop by and say hi. And who's the one having you mow my lawn? I had fun mowing it. I'm going to find out who it is. Do you know who Jesus is, Mr. Barnes? What kind of a question is that? I just wanted to make sure you go to heaven when you die. Well, you don't worry about me. I wanted to make a film that would first please the Lord, and that uh, moviegoers would watch this movie and it would inspire them, it would motivate them to want to live for Christ. This movie has truth in it, and uh, mainly we want to touch their hearts. So when Christians see this film, I hope they're inspired to follow the Lord. And when non-believers see it, I hope they give their life to the Lord. The Secrets of Jonathan Sperry. What he teaches them will last forever.